Shout out Corner Times. I'd like to say thank you to LOL World 345, Roche Chris, Mark the Lone Gamer, Pink Panda Buddy, Welcome to Grim Joe, Chrono Legionnaire, Helen Tat, Back J MacLeo 26. Thank you. Janjil Josh Gregorio, Miss Rizzi, Mr. Rizzi, Alice Alman, Randy H, and Patreon. Thank you for the comments. So please subscribe to my channel. 70% of you guys hasn't subscribed yet. Click that subscribe button down below. And if you want to get a shout out comment on this video to be featured in the next video happening tomorrow. And like, comment, and hit the bell icon for further notification about this channel. So thank you for all the people who supported me along the way. We're 600, and 600 strong. I hope we reach 1k and let's start the video now. Hi guys, it's 2300 Gaming again, bringing you another King of Fighters All-Star content. So right now, time check, it's at like 1, 1.20, 1.40 here in the morning here in uh, in Ireland. So I'm really sleepy, but before I sleep, I need to post content. So content, never sleep guys. So before I go to my bed and like close my eyes and sleep, I would like you to... Um, be notified about the new update so net net marble hasn't stopped yet giving us a lot of content so they gave us the halloween update wherein there's like halloween alice there's guild raids there's new uh, pumpkin there's new rush dungeon and there's new tier 7 cards now as promised this week we got chris and it's the first time in i think King of Fighters All-Star History that a 5-star, uh, no, a FES unit is in the roulette. Just imagine. His a FES unit cost 63 and is in the roulette. Just imagine that. So, just for good measure, I have 3 here. Let's see if I can summon him. Come on. Come on. One more. Oop. Okay. Not that lucky. <laughs> I thought I'm gonna get him in this summon and then like, yeah. So, yeah. I failed to get that, unfortunately. So, you can get Halloween Gate Crasher Chris. So, is he good? Is he good, guys? So, as per the, me the mechanics of Netmarble, they're putting out characters new characters so that you can use them in the content that they're pushing into so right now as you've seen in the dev notes chris halloween chris is a darkness has a darkness mechanic into him so there's like only how many characters there's only psyche and lady geese so there's only two characters who can give darkness in this game at the moment okay and this guy just came in so he's the third unit to give darkness to the enemy and look at his uh, leadership skills so increases purple element fighters attack by 40 percent 45 percent and power charge rate by 20 so you can put nameless on here as well so just imagine he's a purple unit so who else is purple like maxima can be like it's a burn as well so yeah Maxima can be burned, but like usually it's alternating burn or darkness. But like, yeah, it depends on your combination on the guild raid. But he's really good in guild raid because you need darkness to defeat Rugal. Okay, in expert and in uh, the normal uh, mode. Okay, so let's see the core effects. What makes him playable? So, host in the darkness deals 2.3 times of the remaining darkness. So, he has that explosion so deals 2.3 times of the remaining darkness damage to the target and removes darkness upon landing a critical hit and becomes immune to damage wow immune to damage for four seconds when attacked by a target in darkness okay so he has that mechanic just 2.3 times of the remaining darkness damage to the target and then he also becomes immune to damage when he gets hit by a character who has darkness it's not automatic immunity just like um, lady maxima or lady zero but this is like when a character 
an enemy gets hit by darkness, you're immune your immunity will activate for 4 seconds and the cooldown time is 15 seconds and then haha -ha, how silly it increases penetration by 1000 so it penetrates 1000% <laughs> for a small guy like yeah <laughs> for a small guy like Chris yeah, the penetration is real no I'm just joking just kidding <laughs> We're a wholesome, wholesome channel here. Sorry about that. Uh, uh, for seven seconds upon landing a skill on a petrified enemy, so you need first to petrify the enemy before this will affect. And there's a PvP exclusive. It petrifies also the attacker for two seconds when attack while stunned. So, so wait. So, petrifies the attacker for two seconds when attack while stunned so it's just the same as the rio mechanic unfortunately it's not like the vice wherein she returns the stun back to the enemy or um, original zero which returns the stun back to the enemy here together with chris and rio you need to get hit first before you can return back and petrify or stun the enemy okay so it's written here petrifies the attacker for two seconds when attacked while stunned so when you get stunned and then you were attacked that's the time the character will be petrified it's gonna be hard for you to pull it off but like yeah that's his mechanic there so he has a power charge gain by 20% my gosh so he can gain PG very quick and he's a balance type as well so a Noah set can be beneficial for him because like balance type I think gets more damage put with the Noah set Oh no, no, not the Noah set, sorry, sorry, the Kaya set, Kaya set. Because defense uh, defense set cards is also like put, gives a lot of stats to a balance type unit. And I think this one would benefit uh, Halloween Chris more. And then let's go with the skills. This is my first time handling him like, yeah, in real time. Inflicts damage equal to 748 of attack and increases attack for 7 seconds. And this one is the darkness application. Okay, the second would be your super armor and decreases your damage received by 75% for 3 seconds and can be used while being attacked. So, this is an interrupt. So, he has an armor, super armor interrupt skill. This is good. Okay. So, when he's on the ground, like, he, no, when he is standing, he can interrupt a skill. So, he can block, like, for example, nameless attacks you does your uh, does his own thing and then you interrupt him with this second skill you can do that and then third skill inflicts damage equal to 688 attack petrifies the enemy for two seconds upon landing a skill so even guard even when he's guarded when he gets hit just like you know um geese howard geese howard has the mechanic to if you get hit by his skill two even with one hit you're gonna be stunned after the skill is done okay here it will petrify you upon landing a skill guard included so even you're guarding you're gonna get petrified here so decreases the target defense by 30% for 7 seconds upon a successful skill including guard so your your defense will drop significantly by 70 per, 70% and then you're gonna get screwed up by this Chris It's gonna use your his penetration and screw you up <laughs> Lots of pun, lots of pun there. Uh, uh, it's a little bit unfortunate. Let's see his striker. Is there darkness? Okay, yes. So, if you haven't awakened him, he has a darkness striker, thank God. Because Psyche doesn't have a darkness striker on him. So, the only one who gives striker darkness damage is Lady Geese and this guy. So, thankfully, so most likely, even though he's lackluster, looks like he's gonna be lackluster in PvP, but it's... We haven't tested that one yet but his kit seems to be leaning towards the guild raids and pve content uh we'll see we haven't seen him yet in action most likely we will see him in championship later <laughs> everybody will be using him and we'll see his we'll see him in uh, the codex we'll see we'll see where is he here as so the good thing guys as characters are here to stay okay they're not a collab character so 
AS uh, Gatecrasher Alice and AS Gatecrasher Chris is gonna be here in the banner so you're gonna get you're gonna get you're gonna pull them as well and just put them on the top of your pick me up uh, uh, chart so let's see where is Halloween Chris where art thou is he here where is he I still don't have vice I wish I have vice ah uh, there he is check profile skill preview so now we go to the skill preview we haven't gone to the cards yet okay we're just gonna be talking about Chris he looks badass he looks like a, a little devil there so let's see okay first skill hmm it's a little bit slow yeah a little bit slow it dashes up so it's a little bit telegraphic see dash up it's not that quick compared to Alice second skill we'll see ah this one is fast fast but there's up like 0.5 seconds delay on that 0.5 seconds okay but the reach is really far so when you reach him here I'm not quite sure if you can connect with the first skill and the third skill will be here very cool how looks like it's a slow startup we'll see like everything like the first skill and third skill seems to be slow in animation but we'll see in PvP settings if it's really good so unfortunately guys um, Chris has it doesn't have a 3 PG I think because like he can only have the same 5 PG as Chris the regular Chris so yeah this is the boring boring as super just like Chizuru Chizuru's basic attack boring they should have like made it a like flared up like getting big wings or maybe he becomes Iori and uh, he becomes Orochi and then like Pamula character that would be badass but like yeah they just opted with this Chizuru attack chum 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 chang that's it for the super okay so again first skill just the darkness and damage second skill is the super armor and uh, defense down what else so defense oh no, de decrease damage received on the second skill and the third skill is you get petrified plus your defense will drop to 70 percent see decreases defense oh no, no not 70 decreases defense by 30 percent not 70 that's overkill this one is just 30 percent sorry about that sorry for the miss miss number there but it's legit decrease the death to 30 percent for seven seconds it's still big enough okay animation wise a little bit slow on first and third but like yeah it can compensate on his second skill which is fast and has a super armor and can interrupt a character who's attacking because of his mechanic which is you can use it while standing that's a real good uh, mechanic so yep and then that's chris and then we'll proceed to the cards guys they haven't finished it up yet we have cards now again so just before I go to the cards, I have I'm almost having like nine more character pulls to get the pity. So I suggest you guys don't pull for Chris yet, okay? I've heard Mr. Karate is just around the corner. So I suggest you save for your rubies and wait for him to come in so that you have double purpose. You might pull Chris and uh, Mr. Karate at the same time. We'll see. But right now I'm not gonna be. Um, hopefully, while I'm drawing. Uh, daily cards i'm not gonna go to like pity or something i'll try to avoid it i'll just summon maybe like five five times uh like five times per day uh one time per day so that's five so that i can still have enough not to pity any character because i want mr karate for pity because you know chris is in the roulette so there's a high chance that you can get him in the roulette itself or you can collect collect his souls and exchange it for Chris's let's go here 
increase his uh, character. So look at this one. As usual, fighter. That's Chris. You, you need to get 200 of his awaken him uh, to get him. Okay, so you can get him in the roulette uh, as a high chance, and you can get his soul as well. Guys, he's the only first time five uh, fast unit that it's in the roulette. So what a deal! Hopefully everybody can pull him. Okay. So next next update. It's a small update, a quick update. Um, we're gonna be going to the cards, which is you know guys. K is now OP, right? Because of the option card, which is giving him a lot of burn. And the 3PG card, which is really, really handy if you're playing with PvP. But now, they made Kula again. I know Kula is already top tier, but they made her like overkill. I know she doesn't have a, like super armor. But look at this. She has now a 3PG card, which is crazy. Okay? And then, she also has this... So it's just like the the cooldown cards, but this one is with attack, and then decreases cooldown 1.2 1. plus plus guys increases chill damage dealt by 50% for five seconds upon using an active skill. So just imagine your chill damage will be increasing by 50% upon five seconds upon landing an active skill, and everybody, all of your skills would be active skills. So yeah, and then you have the new. New cards here. Who's the unwelcome guest type one? Unfortunately, this one it's a lackluster uh, card because this is only for gold dungeons, I think. Because look at this: increase active skill damage by 20%, increase gold gain by 15%, maintaining a stage, which is, which is yeah, lackluster in itself. Don't get this one. So gold dungeon, how many percent is our gold team? Mm hmm. Let's go to the gold team and let's see how how many percent no 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 not this okay so increase gold gain by 12.6 so yeah it increases like three percent more but still I don't really want to mess around with that card so yeah it's a pass from me to you not to pull for that cards so additionally there's more look at this this is op guys this is this one this one this one this is the orochi card i'm gonna call it orochi card you know why increases critical rate by four percent then increases the burn and darkness damage dealt by 25 percent so it's good for rail boss but but there's a catch there's a good catch special effect increases critical damage by 15 percent just imagine uh, it, you're increasing the burn and you're increasing the critical damage and then they're giving you increased critical rate on this bad boy here so yeah if you're lucky to have it yeah go ahead why not so where is that mm -hmm. oh, I don't know where to put it then hmm uh, who 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 who's this? Ah, I already got that. I haven't got that one yet. Sorry. So, where's that card? Oh, I might miss it. This is like yeah, this one. Just gonna keep that one in, just in case. So. I think that covers everything. So they made uh, Halloween uh, lovely Kula more OP because of the 3PG card. And with this like attack damage and increase cooldown card. Cooldown time card exclusively for Alice. That's good. So yeah, she will only get the exclusive if it's combined with Alice. No, no, not Alice. Sorry. I'm a little bit sleepy. Lovely Kula. Okay, I'm saying Alice, Alice, Alice. No. If you equip that uh, option card for Kula, it will activate that special effect on her. Okay, so yeah, I think that's the small update that Netmarble has given us. So are, am I pulling for him? No. Wait for Mr. Karate. Hopefully he will come next week. We'll see. So 
I think that's my emergency video just to summarize what's new that's what they gave us today new cards new option cards and oh wait 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 I want to see I want to see that super in action before I go lovely cool is gonna be OP now she's already OP but like this much much stronger for Skula skill let's do the preview let's see the 3pg before I I go sleepy sleep so this one is the 3pg near freeze whoa ho, 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 ho. Whoa, 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 like AOE crowd, oh, my gosh. Whoa, that's cool. And it's a 3PG card, man. Wow. Lovely Gula will be OP in the next coming PV matches. So, yeah, I think that's it. Anything else did I miss? Just leave in the comment section down below. But, like, I think that's the meat and potatoes of the update and his cards and yep anything else under the sun so that's it for now this again 2300 gaming I post King of Fighters content I post every day so like and subscribe spread the word help me reach 1000 subscribers and without you guys I'm nothing here okay so thank you again and I'm really sleepy I'm gonna be sleeping now but I need to render this video and send it to you guys so that you can see what's going on at the moment so i think you need to save your rubies don't pull for him yet wait for mr karate if you're if you want if you're having doubts yeah just wait for mr karate he's gonna be coming in i'm not quite sure if next week i've heard that he's gonna be coming next week so save your rubies okay guys again this is 2300 gaming and i'm out peace